Okay, so we're bringing you three videos, a beginners, an intermediate, and an advanced video. This is the beginners video. So for all you people out there that are sat on your sofas right now, or who tune in every day and watch our videos and are just inspired but have no idea where to start, we've listened to you and we've designed a program just for you. So we're gonna bring you exercises that you can do, that are doable, that are gonna make you sweat, that are gonna give you a workout, but more importantly, they're gonna be at your level. So they're gonna be broken down and it's gonna give you somewhere to start. And that's the most important thing. We want to get you working out. We want no excuses. We want you training with us every day. So go and get your trainers. I'm gonna bring you a workout that you can do, that is doable, and all the exercises you will be able to achieve and you're gonna feel amazing at the end of it. Are you ready? Let's do it. I'm ready. Abs. <sighs> 10 seconds. Okay, so for those of you that just tuned in, this timer here that you can hear beeping is the Budorock Interval Timer. The reason that we use this is because it keeps you on track. So it keeps you 50 seconds work, and then it'll beep, then you get your rest, and then you do your 50 seconds work again. If you are just starting out, and the 10 seconds rest is too quick for you, just increase your rest just while you're just starting and getting used to it. You will find that 10 seconds becomes plenty. When you first start though, it can seem like that. So if you want to increase your rest, that's absolutely fine. You can do that. So the exercises that we did, we started off with prisoner squat jumps. Hands behind your head. You're gonna jump in and out with the legs. Keep them nice and low. Do as many as you can, then have a rest. Just do as many as you can. Write down how many you get done in the 50 seconds before the beat goes, okay? Okay, abs. So on the floor, straight body line, make sure you, you've not arched your back, keep it flat to the mat. Hands on your legs, you're gonna run up your legs to your knees, then come back down. Run the hands up, and then come back down. Make sure you're pulling your abs in nice and tight, and look up to the ceiling. Do as many as you can. Write down your scores for 50 seconds, and then we move on to number three. Ready? Okay, exercise three, reverse pull-ups. So, some of you may not have these. If you haven't, get onto the website. There's loads of people that have got ideas for what you can use. You can use two chairs with a, with a pole. You can use the edge of your table to pull yourself up. Really be creative. Look around the house, go outside, find things that you can use. So, this is the exercise. You're gonna come into your body rock equalizer, weight into the feet and you're going to pull your arm, your body up towards your hands as high as you can and then take yourself back down. Pull it up, take yourself back down. Make sure your core's nice and tight. If you only get one, two, three of them, that's absolutely fine. Just do as many as you can. Do one, then have a rest. Do another and then have a rest. You will find yourself doing a lot more very quickly. You'll be surprised how strong you are. So, exercise four. Okay, last exercise, step ups. I use this box, it's quite high, so you may want to get something a bit smaller because when you start and you go, oh, this is quite high, you're kind of in there, so you can't really stop. So what you're gonna do is get nice and close to your box. Don't step too far away because that's not gonna help. So nice and close. Step up with one leg, breathe, step that leg back down. Change legs, step up, big breath, core tight, step back down. You're going to do that for 50 seconds. So, four exercises, three times through, 50 seconds work, 
and a 10 second rest. If you need a longer rest, that's absolutely fine. Wherever you need to start, just do the best you can. Something is better than nothing. That's what we always say. So, what I want to tell you is, please log onto the Facebook, log onto the website. We are online all day. All you need to do is if you need somewhere to start, if you're struggling and you just want to get fit or just find a place that you can start or communicate or if you have any problems whatsoever, just log on. All you've got to do is log on, ask us a question and we will be there for you and we will help you. There are hundreds and hundreds of people who have seen results every single day logging onto the Facebook. So if you need to be inspired and you just want to find out what all this is about, just come and say hi and we'll we'll tell you and we'll answer your questions. Go and speak to other people. They've got ideas for everything. Recipes, diet tips, you name it, it's all on there. So please come and say hello. Just put me a little hi and I'll hi you back and get body rocking because I promise you, you will absolutely love it. I hope you enjoyed this workout. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know if you ache tomorrow, which you probably will. Um, and I'll see you real soon. Bye. Okay, so for those of you that don't have equipment and every day you log on and go, I can't do this, I don't have the equipment, I have been you. I know your pain. You need to be creative. You need to get outside. You need to find things around the house. There's so many things you can use. I've done it, so I know you can do it. This is one of them. For those of you that haven't got the equalizer, that haven't got a dip station, get on your table. Just get the cheers away, not while people are eating at it. <laughs> <laughs> right, so hands on the table. Make sure your shoulder is just under the table. Watch. <sighs> ah, yeah, you're impressed. <sighs> Go back down. Ta da One dip station. So log on, tell me your ideas, tell me what you use. I'd love it in a picture form because people love pictures. So if you can take a picture of what you use instead of the equipment, help others out. Come on, they need your help. That's my tip for you. What are you gonna give me? It's a 50-50 thing, come on. <laughs>